back to the show, y'all. In this video, I'm going to share with you guys another great pickup that I got from the Dollar Tree. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, I would say they upgraded their brooms, Dollar Tree. Now, it comes with uh, this brush. That's a broom, really. And I say you make a switch broom out of it. It's actually, it comes with the handle and everything, as you can see right here. You can screw the handle. I don't never use the handle that comes with the brush. You get it from your Dollar Tree. And uh, I think they upgraded these brushes now from my previous video. As you guys can see here, it's made out of very sturdy plastic. Uh, the bristles and stuff is much, much better than it was on an old Swiss broom brush. Anyway, I wanted to share it with you, with y'all. As you can see here, the bristles is a little more sturdier on this brush here come from Dollar Tree and I thought it was a pretty good brush um, for you guys the latest gentlemen watching in that you can sweep your floors with it and the Dollar Tree has them they, it ain't quite as um cheap made as the previous brush that I shared with you guys about a, three weeks to a month ago I actually picked this one up just the other day I didn't see it in the other two Dollar Trees that I went to I seen in a particular one I went in, and two of them that I went to, they didn't even have this brush, broom rather. So anyway, let's see what it does, guys. I'm going to hit the carpets here, my Nissan Pathfinder. This is the truck we working with right here. Y'all are pretty familiar with this truck. Mess with it a lot. So uh, I'm going to get down this way here. You can see the dirt and stuff little bit of dirt that we have right here let's see what it do for it shall we okay. as you can see how I just pulling out that grind the brush itself works pretty good that thing won't pull that much out but it did make a great switch broom they call them all that dollar then when you need it to sweep your house or your porch or whatever like that you can just screw your handle on this thing. It's got a little place right here where you screw your handle on. Just pull that little piece of tape off. Or you can just buy another one. Have one for sweeping up your house. And one for your car. Uh, this got some pretty good bristles on them, as you can see. It's pretty sturdy, too. Well, I just said I wanted to share it. And it sweeps very well, as you guys can see. It swept all that trash out of the cracks and stuff here. A lot of stuff you can think, think outside the box to do for detailing. And as you can see, there's really no certain items needed in detailing. You can detail really good with dollar items. Just got to use your head on a lot of stuff. Now I just pulled all, and you can get up under the accelerator really good here with this brush. See here? I mean, it goes right underneath accelerator just like soaps here very flexible it just does a good job it's about better than a vacuum cleaner to be honest it's very flexible so all that trash it just pulled out from there it's this dollar tree brush man going up in there and get all that crap and at the same time when you're using a brush like this it's help pulling the nap and all that stuff up on your carpets. As you can see, I just pulled a lot of trash from up under the accelerator. Powder and stuff there. It looks pretty good, too, as well. Under there. And uh, <laughs> y'all know me. I bring y'all that cheap stuff, man. To try to motivate y'all to get out there. Do detailing jobs without spending a whole lot of money. You know, it's just unnecessary. So uh, let's finish getting this trash. Let's see how the trash it pulled out here. Let's brush it on. Let's brush it on. What's this? This thing may work wonders, man. I mean, it's just done a good job here. Strong bristles. See there? carpet is really clean there now as you can see I mean, it's pretty much 
took all the trash and everything off. And I would say you can get another one. Also, you can get one to do your seats with it. Like, sweep your seats. You're going to get the trash, the lint, the dust, and the derbies. And stuff off your seats and stuff like this. I mean, as y'all see, how good it does. Doing a good job here. All right, here we go. As you can see, doing a pretty good job here. Check that out. My carpet's looking all good. Y'all saw the trash that I pulled from under the accelerator pedal and stuff. Out in the corner right here, pulled a lot of trash out of here. And it works, man. Uh, <laughs> can't scratch no more. It's a Dollar Tree brush. Um, it did the job, as you can see here. And I like where I can get right up under them accelerator pedals and stuff. Sometimes it's hard to get up under places like that, but this brush made it easy. To be honest. So, uh, I just want to share that with y'all, man. I don't hold y'all too long. You know, no big deal. Y'all know how we do. And you could continue this process all over the whole entire truck. If you got a lot of trash or whatnot in here, you can go ahead on, you know, get the job done this way. You know, you'll be right, man. Uh, to get the job done so uh y'all see how good it looks i mean that carpet has some trash on it too and boy if it did a pretty good job and you can just go into your seats now if you need to be but your carpet is straight it's straight enough anyway you know it's just just for sweeping it did an excellent job here. And the bristles are pretty strong, as you can see. There's a bird down here. Strong bristles. There. Kind of stiff, like strong. So, great brush. If y'all need to rush on out to your Dollar Tree and uh, pick you up one of them brushes, man. Get your detailing on out there. <laughs> Oh, y'all know me, man. I bring some good stuff to you, man. You know, save some money out there, man. That's what the name of the game is. Save a few dollars. That's how you want to do it. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. I hope I shed some light on a good detailing brush y'all can go get out there. Till next time, man. Y'all hit that subscribe and I'm out of here. Peace. Check my kid out. He. So hi to the camera. Can't say hey y'all. I'm out. <laughs> Peace.